Well, hello everybody. Happy New Year. <laughs> I know y'all like your ass has been gone from YouTube for like months and you have the nerve. Yes, Happy New Year everybody. Um, let's see, Talk Tuesday. I figured I'd use this time to kind of update you to what's been going on with me, which life has happened. Um, Nothing bad or anything like that, but as you guys know, if you don't already know, I am a full-time nurse. So, um, nursing, my full-time nursing job has really taken a lot of my extra time um, when I do extra shifts and so forth and so on. Um, and that leads me to say, you know, I've gotten quite a few questions on how how come I don't implement my nursing career into my YouTube channel. And the reason, the main reason why I don't speak a lot on nursing topics is because I don't want it to interfere with patient confidentiality, HIPAA, even talking about situations and not mentioning any names. You know, it's, you can kind of narrow down where I work, you know, so I really just don't want the extra um, potential backlash from exposing uh, things that I may go through on the job that I'm on now. So that's why I don't talk about my nursing stuff. But as you guys know, yes, I do still work full-time nursing. I'd rather be in the ER <laughs> or uh, mother baby. Not labor and delivery, but mother baby. I think I can take care of somebody's kids. Um, let's see. Where else have I been? Um, I just It's just so much that I have going on in my head. There's so many uh, reviews um, to the companies who have, have sent me stuff over the past months. Um, independent and mainstream um, my deepest apologies I usually I try to I've tried in the past to review things in a timely fashion but I just know that everybody is pretty much upset with Coco right now okay because I have not been able to um, uh, get everything in order like uh, it's just so much going on in here that I find myself juggling my day and it's just a lot at times. So I had to step back from what I was doing on YouTube, not because I didn't like it, just because it just, it started to wear and tear on me trying to put in everything and still give you the quality of videos, the quality of reviews. I just had to take a break, okay, and deal with everyday life. So I'm sure you guys can understand that. Um, Lock Chronicles, I'm slacking. I wanna come back to Sunday Morning Song. I wanna, I just, I wanna do so much, but I think what I have to do now is just internalize a lot of things that I'm dealing with and uh, get back on track, okay? Um, and shout out to Barbadian. Um, Miani, I just wanna thank you so much because I was telling her on Instagram that uh, I was watching Steve Harvey the other day and she had always talked about this book, The Secret. And I was like, well, I don't know, I don't know if I have time to read it, but listening to Steve Harvey, I immediately thought of her. And I was just like, wait a second. I've heard her, um, a couple other people here on YouTube that have talked about that book, but it's, it's an inspirational, get it together, help you focus, maintain, put, put into perspective what's important, what's not, what your goals are. I need that right now. So I'm gonna, um, I didn't get it today because I wanted to download it from my iPad. And yes, I am rambling, but I hadn't seen y'all in so long, that's why. Ooh, let's see. Um, I don't really have any current events. Um, of course, I wanna bring back Talk Tuesday and have more substance on the Talk Tuesday segment. I wanna bring back my earrings and things. Um, I got a new camera, well, my own camera, cause you know, I got tired of cameraman telling me when I can record and when I couldn't record. It wasn't fun, fun, people. It wasn't fun. Mm -hmm. Deuces. He's so ignorant sometimes. Anyway, um, so yeah, I got a new camera that I'm working with, something that I can use. And it is the Canon SX50HS. Um, 
kind of looks like a setup. One of these days I go into the camera setup. Um, so I'm not shooting with the Mark D right now. So I don't know how it's going to come across, how it's going to um, transpire on the screen. So we'll see. Um, let's see what else. Current events. The Super Bowl, the Ravens. Ooh, I was looking for the underdogs. I'm not even I'm not even a football person, so yeah. Um Oh, Beyonce in the halftime. Y'all know I had to I really don't go there, but I'm a little bit pissed because I'm not a big diehard Beyonce fan. I'm not, but I think my girl is bad to the bone. She's multi-talented, she's beautiful, she's a mommy, she's a wife. She has so many positive things going for her. So I said, okay. I knew she was coming to the Atlanta area. Actually, she's gonna be in Duluth at the, um, is it the Gwinnett Town Center Stadium? Gwinnett Stadium? It's in Gwinnett County where I, where I live, but um, she's coming really close. So I figured, let me go online and let me secure my ticket, okay? And when I looked up the ticket, y'all, I was blown. I was blown because if research serves me right, Michael Jackson tickets weren't even this much, okay? Her tickets range from nosebleed, super duper nosebleed at $141 to all the way to the floor, which I kind of wanted to not necessarily be on the floor, but keep in mind, the floor is standing room, okay? You stand in. You don't have no seat. Floor is 1838. So her tickets range from $141 to 1838. And of course, the ticket that I wanted is somewhere in the middle at $700. B, I don't think so, boo. You, Miss Carter, B, whatever you want to call yourself, boo, you're not about to get that out of me. I love you, girl. I'll keep on buying your records. But I don't need to see you on concert. I'll just have to replay that um, Super Bowl event and we go with that. Because being lost a damn mind, I don't know what she's thinking because mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. I care a lot about my duckets, but I'm not about to put drop 700 like that. Like I don't even have a pair of um, Christian Louboutin. I don't even have, I don't even have, I don't even have a pair of those shoes. I don't even own a $700 handbag. Like my car don't even cost $700. Like that'll be two months of my car no. Um, what else? No, I was just feeling some kind of way about that. So if you follow me on Facebook, that's where all that ranting comes from. Speaking of Facebook, um, if you don't know, I remember, I already know, I do have a fan, Facebook fan page that I've kind of dropped by the wayside as well, but I plan on picking that back up. And if you've been on IG, you know that I haven't really gone anywhere because I'm constantly posting over on the IG side. So you'll always be able to keep up with me there and things that I may have purchased. Um, Instagram is just so much fun. It is. So make sure you hit me up on Instagram. And uh, uh, I guess you can officially say I'm back. We'll see how this goes. In my mind, the goal is to have at least two videos a week. Um, whatever they are, there'll be two videos a week. And I'm going to try to post those on the beginning part of the week. Um, and whenever else I feel like posting. How about that? Okay. So it was good seeing you guys. I just want to say thank you to each and every one of you who are still subscribing to my channel. Although I have not um, produced a video in so many months. Um, thank you for the my ride or die people that have been there with me from the beginning that that still hit me up on the email um, That inbox me that you know speak highly of me I really do appreciate that and that makes me feel like you know, hey, she's been missed So I miss you guys as well And if I could have been doing videos in this time if I had the, had the moment and had the opportunity I would have but um, yeah, I'm gonna do better. Okay, it's, I'm gonna do better so, uh, yeah, stay tuned for more to come, I should say. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye.